In this tutorial, I'll show you how to create a spinning party ball animation. Create a UV sphere. We need 16 segments. Create a new circle. If you don't see a circle mesh, activate an add-on called Add Mesh, Extra Objects. Scale the circle mesh, press tab to go to edit mode and fill with F. Select the circle mesh and shift select the sphere. Press Ctrl P to parent. Go to object, instancing, faces. Press Ctrl A and select Make Instances Real to make them unique. It looks like the circle mesh is too big. Undo and scale the circle mesh down. We can add a material to one of the circles and duplicate the material. Or we can undo and apply a material to the original circle mesh. We need emission, object info and color ramp nodes. Add more colors and set it as constant. Activate Bloom and increase the strength of the emission shader. We can make an animation by rotating all of these separate circles meshes or just use one empty object. It will be better to animate with the empty object. Let's select all circle meshes and shift select the empty object. Press Ctrl P to parent. On the frame 1, press I as in India on the Z rotation. Go to frame 60, change the rotation to 360 and then press I.
We can increase the strength and decrease it. Do you see how the animation starts to slow down as it approaches the frame 60? We can fix that like this. Go to the Animation tab and select the Graph Editor. Select all circle meshes and right click here to select the linear. It doesn't slow down anymore. I like this emission strength animation. We can press I on the emission strength to animate it. Keyframe 1 and 60 should have the same value and the keyframe 30 should have the increased value. This is the end of the Party Ball animation tutorial. Please like and subscribe, if you have enjoyed watching this tutorial. Also, please remember to use the share button below to share this tutorial on social media. Thank you for watching.